Hey guys, how's it going? This is Helpful Lockpicker here, and today I got something pretty cool in the mail. In the mail I received a full-sized aluminum pinning tray from LockVault.com, and also the new prototype of the miniature-sized aluminum pinning tray. What I'm going to do is I'm going to unbox this for you and share some of my thoughts on these pinning trays in just a moment. Please stay tuned. All right, so let's get this box open right now. All right, so I have the two trays unboxed right now and they look really, really nice in person. The first item that I received is this mini pinning tray sold by LockFall.com. This is a very new item that they recently just started selling. This tray has a very small form factor and is the more affordable option of pinning tray that they sell. What I really enjoy about this tray is it has eight different slots for you to be able to put pens down on. It has a really nice area on the top here for you to put any miscellaneous things like C-clips or whatever you may take off in the process of getting a lock apart. It does have a very small area for you to put a plug, but in order to truly utilize that, you're gonna to need to use a pretty small plug because it may not fit some of the bigger plugs. But what I really enjoy about this tray is gonna be the price at $35 and just the form factor. This tray is not very large at all. So this is one of the prototype trays. It's the prototype 002. LockVault.com has started selling them, and you can order one today if you'd be interested. The only thing that you won't be able to do that you can see on mine is you can see that I have my logo printed right on the top here. He does not currently offer getting an engraved logo, but if you really want one, you could always reach out to him and see if he'd be able to do it. So the key points that I enjoy about this tray is one, the price. $35 is not a bad price. Considering the full price of $75 if you were to get the bigger one, it is a really nice form factor. It is going to fit very well. It has these little grips on the bottom here so it will not fall off your table. It is lightweight and fits in your pocket very easily. One tray that you can compare this to is a tray that many people have seen before if you've been in Locksport any amount of time, and it's going to be the Sparrows Mini Pinning Tray. You can see that they are both roughly the same size. If I put one on top of the other, you're going to see that they match up very, very well. What I really like about this tray is that it is not going to be bending in the middle. When you pick it up, you could drop some of the pens like you could on this rubber version. This tray is very solid if you're going to pick it up and try to show the pens to the camera up close. The one downside to this tray is that you can see that the light that's hitting it can be quite reflective, and sometimes you need to angle the tray in a way to make it a little bit less reflective if that is getting in the way of the video. But what I'd like to do now is to show you a quick example of me using this tray. And all I'm going to do is place a couple pens on it. The one thing I would really like to see on the tray is seeing the chambers numbered. But as you can see that there really isn't going to be much room for you to put numbers on each individual slot. But I'm so used to doing on all of my trays one starting here and going right to left and that is what I'm going to do today. So I'm just going to drop a couple miscellaneous pens onto this tray and you can see how they contrast against the aluminum color of the pinning tray. Alright, so now I have five pens on this tray and I think it does a pretty good job. It really does show them off. It holds them in place and I can move the tray around and you can see that they did not completely fall out of place and they are staying in there very, very well. So what I'd like to do now is to show you a quick example of the larger version of this tray that you can get for $75. Now that we have seen the mini pinning tray offered by LockFall.com, what I have in front of us here is the full-size aluminum pinning tray starting off at $75. This tray comes in three different materials. You can get it in aluminum, brass, and copper. The copper tray is the most expensive material which maxes out at $125. What I really like about this tray is that it is a much bigger tray. It's about three times as wide and all of the stuff is more spaced out so that you will not have to feel like everything is just cramped together. 
What I enjoy about this tray is when you're starting to take apart a lock, you are less likely to get a pen in the wrong slot because you have more room in between each slot. This tray comes with seven slots going across here. And one really cool feature about this tray is it is also equipped to deal with disc detainer locks. You can see all of these cutouts right here are going to be for the discs for a disc detainer lock. Not many trays come properly equipped to take apart a disc detainer lock, and this is a really cool key feature of this tray that you may not see in other trays. It comes with a cutout here to put a plug in so you can secure that while you're working. It has a really nice cutout here for any of the miscellaneous items that you may run into, like a C-clip when you're taking apart a lock that you do not want to lose. My favorite part of this tray is going to be that you can put your own custom logo on here that can really help you personalize this tray and really make it your own. Lockfall.com highly recommends if you're going to take this route that you send them a vector format file or you send them an image with a high resolution. Getting your own custom logo will cost an additional price, but it is something really fun to do. One thing I really find cool about these trays too is they all come with a custom serial number on the back. You can see this one is serial number 008. So these trays are really fun to have. They are very useful and I really enjoy having it. So you can see that this tray is much bigger than the mini pinning tray. It is about three times as wide. The heights match out pretty well, but you can see one, two, three. But when you're looking at this, you really need to look at what do you need the tray for and what is your budget. For $35, you can get a really cool tray that is going to be really great for pen tumbler locks. You have eight slots and you have everything you need to be able to take a lock apart and keep the pens separated. But if you want to try to advance in the sport and you're going to want to future proof yourself, it's going to be really cool to have a nice spaced out tray, one that looks very professional and one that can handle disc container locks. But either way, the choice is yours and no matter what you do, you cannot go wrong. All of these trays are expertly made with a CNC machine and they are all very exact and precisely made and they are really nice trays to own. So if you are interested in checking out one of these trays, I highly recommend that you go over to www.lockfall.com and just check out any of the offerings that he has. Another thing that he's going to start offering pretty soon is going to be a silver bullet disc detainer lock pick. He is still working on trying to fix out some of the kinks and getting the production started, but that is going to be something very exciting for the sport once that gets completely finalized. But either way, guys, this is all that I have for you today. This has been a really cool unboxing and quick review and showing of Lockfall.com's printing trays. These trays are going to be the trays that I'm going to use when I take apart locks, and I highly recommend that you check them out. But either way, guys, thank you so much for checking out this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more like it, please subscribe. As always, thank you so much for checking out this video, and I hope you all have a great day, and just thank you so much for checking this out.